Hi everyone! This is a quick follow-up to my previous video about repairing this uh, Fluke scope meter. I designed the replacement uh, keypad board uh, instead of this original thing from Fluke, which they call foil, and as I understand they fail quite often. And uh, I goofed up the pinout for this connector. As I explained, if uh, we put such a flat flex cable between two connectors uh, the first pin in this connector becomes the last pin in this one but after publishing that video I realized that there is a very easy fix for this and now I wonder how this didn't occur to me right away we don't have to use uh, flat flex with contacts on the same side they exist with contacts on the opposite sides. Imagine these contacts on that side instead. So that the first pin in this connector goes to the first pin on that side. No problem at all. Here is the cable we want. 1 mm pitch, 15 positions, 100 mm length and opposite side contacts. And this one is a bit more expensive, about three dollars, and that's because of a different manufacturer. Here is the cable I bought with the same side contacts for dollar twenty-one, and uh, for some reason there is no opposite side version from this manufacturer. And this also solves another problem I have here, which I didn't get to in my video. It turns out that I miscalculated the number of turns this flat flex needs to make here. Let's see, this uh, board is sitting like so, and this connector was supposed to sit like so. Let me see if I can align it. Uh, There you go. So a flat flex was supposed to start like this, then it needs to flip, then flip again, and then it needs to go down into that connector, so it needs to flip again, and that's the wrong way. And because I decided to put the connector on this side, the flat flex starts this way, and that adds one more flip. So it goes this way, flips like this, flips like this, and then goes down like this, and this is the right way. However, if we use a flat flex with contacts on the opposite sides, so imagine this one is on the other side, and uh, again we start like this, and then it flips this way, flips again, and then goes down, and this is on the other side, like this, no problem. So it turns out that this design is perfectly fine after all, no problem at all. Everything is obvious once you know the answer. Thanks for watching, bye.